Wobbling Wed West. Well, good morning and welcome to War of Witweeds. Coming to you especially this morning from Bellamy's Garage. It really is wonderful to be here. And first of all, let me tell you what is wrong with this wonderful old unreliable foreign car. Yes, this car has got engine trouble. Yes, that's right, engine trouble. Now, you probably sat there thinking to yourselves, hang on a minute, he means engine trouble. Well, I know what I meant. I meant engine trouble. Just have a look at this. <coughs> yes, it's easy to be an expert once you know how. Oh. Oh. Obviously a weird engine model. <laughs> Now here, on this roadside wall of retweets, we can find many interesting specimens. For instance, just look at the bottom of this wonderful retweet. <laughs> we can find many interesting creatures. These slippery reptiles can be found normally in Africa or Western Europe. But just look at that. There they are, languishing on the bottom of this windscreen. Of course, it's our old friend, the windscreen viper. <laughs> now then, if we grope about underneath this bonnet, oi! Come over here. If we grope about inside this bonnet, we can find many interesting specimens. For instance, this is the well-known bee in the bonnet. And for all you apiarists looking in, this amazing creature is known as the Boy Scout variety, or the bee prepared. And grapple me great nuts, just look at that. This is the popular home of the farmyard hen. She naturally enjoys her environment. Of course she does, because where else would a hen live except in a hen's inn? <laughs> As you can see from its natural habitat, it is, of course, a battery hen. This is the stuff. Now then, if you look under this vehicle, you can see many, many oil patches. Now, this is really terrific, because we can grow our favourite vegetables. Yes, the tasty and delicious oil leek. Now then. <laughs> well, what have we got here in the back of this amazing vehicle? As you can see, this is probably the finest example of British wildlife ever. We've got two specimens here, one male, one female. And notice this strange noise emanating from the orifice in the face when the male nibbles the female's ear hole. And look at the way they eventually intertwine. This could spread very easily, so we must take evasive action with our special weed killer, or as we like to call it, bucket and freeze and liquidus, or the cold bucket of water. Ah! Ah! The motor car is not only using up our world supply of energy, it is also polluting our environment. So I myself choose not to use a motor car. I use a cheaper and cleaner form of transportation. The good old travel. Yes, it's cheaper and much cleaner. Yes, pig'em, transport'em, pork'em, or the piggyback. So for me, DD, it's bye-bye. Where Robin Wedwest goes, tweet tweet, woo wee tweet, woo wee tweet, it's really wonderful in war.